Welcome back. Today I'm going to be drawing Hello Kitty. So let's get started. I'm first going to start with the eyes. So I'm going to make an oval shape here and then I'm going to leave quite a bit of space in between. I'm going to make another oval shape on this side and then about parallel with the bottom of the eyes or even and in the center we're going to make a horizontal oval shape. Dropping down slightly from the center, this will be kind of the center of the face, we're going to make the shape of her face. So we'll bring a curve line up and around, and we're going to do that on both sides. Uh, try to make it symmetrical, meaning it's the same distance on this side as it is on this side. So as we get to about this part, uh, we're going to make some rounded triangular shapes for her ears. So one here, and then I'll come over to this side and another kind of rounded triangular shape, and then a curved line to connect those. All right, so about here, I'm gonna make a diagonal oval shape. And what I'm gonna do now is kind of just draw through her ear area here, and then we'll come back and erase this overlapped line. Same thing on this side, kind of just drawing through. And let's clean up the drawing. So I'm going to erase this overlap line as well as this overlap line here. And let's make a detail inside of her bow. So it's going to be kind of two curved shapes there. All right, we'll add our whiskers on the side of her face. So one, two, and three. Same thing on this side. And for her body, it's just going to be kind of a larger trapezoid, rounded trapezoid shape. So I'm going to come here and come all the way down, a little bump in the center, and then back up on this side. Her arms are just kind of at her side, so it's a diagonal line down, curved line, and then a curve, larger curved line back into her body. Diagonal line down, curved line, and a larger curved line back into her body. Curve lines for her sleeves. I'm gonna make a horizontal line going across the bottom, toward the bottom of her body, a center line for her legs, and then a curve line for her collar. Okay, so to start adding some color, I'm first gonna start with yellow, and I'm gonna to start to fill in her sleeves. and her kind of shirt area below her head here, her face, and her other sleeve. And I'm also gonna fill in her nose, this color. I'm gonna move on to red, and I'm going to make her bow red. Again, if you want, you can vary the colors. It doesn't necessarily have to be these these colors that I'm using. Um, I've seen Hello Kitty in some really cool pink colors and uh, purples. So totally your preference, whatever whatever colors you want to use. Also, you can make um, you know kind of a few of them and do different colors, so variations. So that's a lot of fun too. Uh, now I'm going to jump into the blue. Just kind of outline around the yellow. I'm gonna just kind of go over this line and then I'll come back and fill it in with my uh, water part of the marker. Okay, around the collar one more time. Here's the wider part of the marker just to fill in some of these larger marker strokes or this larger space with the, the marker stroke here. It is garbage collection day. I don't know if you guys can hear that. The loud truck outside. Now, what I'm going to do is use my black outlining marker to fill in the eyes. And then I'm just 
can use this to outline the rest of the drawing. Outlining, as we always talk about, is very important. Just emphasizes all the lines we really want to see. Um, and cleans up the drawing as well. I'm going to outline her whiskers here. And her body. And her arms around her hands, her sleeves. And that is going to be the drawing for Hello Kitty. I hope you guys really enjoyed this one. Uh, give it a try. It's a lot of fun. Bye.